many talented comedians, which is why tonight will be very easy. <laughs> Speaking of easy, Negan is here. <laughs> Don't worry, she's not mad at the joke. She's just happy I remembered her name for once. <laughs> I thought this. <laughs> Corey is hosting tonight. And the only thing funny about Corey is that he doesn't think that he has a learning disability. <laughs> you do! You're dumb! <laughs> All right, I'm thrilled to be at this non-paying gig tonight. In fact, this is the only non-paying gig I've ever had. Let that sink in, guys. Let that sink in. But since we're talking about not getting paid to perform, let's talk about Turtle. <laughs> Look. Turtle looks so good tonight. Make some noise for him, guys. You should get your heart broken more often because that depression weight loss looks amazing. Where is this bullshit? All right. Me and Turtle, here we go, buddy. We've always had some kind of connection, right? But we could never date. We're both too similar. We're both arrogant. We're both narcissistic. We're both assholes. The only difference is, is that I've been on TV and he hasn't. <laughs> I should have been Ryan that night, not you, you ugly motherfucker. God damn it. <laughs> All right, let's get into it. We're gonna go now. When me and Turtle fucked, I didn't even know we were having sex. Not because I was blacked out or because I'm an alcoholic, it's because his dick is so small, I thought he was fingering me. <laughs> but keep going, Turtle. I hear all girls in Atlanta love guys with tiny cocks that say the N word too much. <laughs> <laughs> Turtle, what the fuck are you gonna do in Atlanta? Seriously, how are you gonna act? No, but seriously, how are you, do you think you're gonna get an acting job? You did in here, what's a new zip code gonna do? But no, keep going, Turtle, we believe in you. Time for you. All right, let's talk about good, bad stories. All right. That's the not so good show Corey and Frank produce. I don't go to it anymore, because if I wanted to listen to a bunch of nobody comedians tell bad stories and fake laugh at each other's jokes, I'd just listen to the True Serum Podcast. No. Listen, don't get me wrong, Frank, Corey, and Ryan's podcast is a way of showing their 22 friends that they're trying to make it. But it's so boring that listening to it might drive me to relapse. So I'm gonna have to pass. But hey, oh shit. <laughs> At least it's not as bad as Zach Brown's. That shit is awful. <laughs> it's written down. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> I used to hang out with Frank, Corey, and Ryan almost every day. And then I got sober and they stopped hanging out with me. I, I, at first I thought it was me. And then I realized it was me. Me without alcohol is like turtle without a penis pump. It just doesn't work. 